Hello, Tony here. So in today's video, we are going to be talking about this money. Yes, on today's video, I will show you how to earn money with Peakmaker on Fiverr. Uh, it's a very detailed video where I show you exactly how to use this tool called Peakmaker to earn and make money on Fiverr. So make sure you watch to the end and pay close attention. Let's get started. Okay guys, so before I even get started with this video, before I start explaining how PicMaker works, the whole interface of PicMaker, how you can take advantage of it and start making money, I want to quickly show you proof that people are already making money uh, by leveraging on this particular software and other softwares out there, which in my own case, I will show you how to use uh, PicMaker to your own advantage. So right on the screen, you see that this person, this is a particular seller on Fiverr. Uh, this person has 14 orders in queue, isn't it? And uh, this person sells the service for $25 and just delivers in two days. Which, it won't even take this person to 10 minutes to design this. And this is what this person is doing. Design, design, okay, these are the design this person... These are design he already, he or she already did on, on, on Fiverr and got paid for. Okay, these are designs, and you can see they are very simple design, very simple. Already has 14 orders in queue, and I've sold over 3,663 services doing just these simple designs. And not just this person, if you open up, this is another seller with five orders in queue, over 364 sold already. This is another person, four orders in queue, with 390 sold already. Okay, so this is actually a way I can actually make money using this particular to revenge on this particular tool I'm, I'm to introduce to you right now okay so you don't need to be techy you don't need to know photoshop and all those uh you know complicated softwares you don't need to know to be able to put up these graphics and make money on fiverr okay so that is where this particular software called pickmaker comes in Maker. So, this uh, software, I'm just going to give you a rundown of the whole interface of this particular software. Okay, just go over to this website. I'll also leave a link in the description, uh, app.pickmaker.com, okay, to lead you to this uh, place. Uh, but you see, I'm seeing this, this dashboard right now because I already logged in. I'm a user already on this particular platform. So, but for you, you need to sign up either with your email uh you know it's, it's very simple the sign up process is very simple you need to sign up okay and when you log in make sure that you, ver you verify after signing up make sure that you verify your mail you activate your account okay so having done that uh then you log on and you'll be led to this particular page so first of all on the right left hand side uh you see uh create okay this is where if you want to create any design uh youtube thumbnail uh, YouTube ads, logos, you know, different, different uh, graphic designs, graphic design up to that, so many of them, okay, worksheet and all of those things, okay, what this particular button does is, it has a, an already made size for it, like, for example, if I want to design, if I choose YouTube thumbnail, okay, if I choose YouTube thumbnail, it will ask me either to use a blank page or template, Okay, let me just open up to template to a new tab so you guys see what I, uh, I mean. So if I open up to template, the size that it, it chose is YouTube thumbnail. Okay, and the templates are already here. So if you need to make designs uh, on YouTube thumbnails, okay, the size is already set for you and you, you want to make that a uh, thumbnail uh, from templates, all you need to do is just to scroll down and select any template that you choose, whichever that sits well with you, and click on use, and it will open up to a new tab where you know you get to use them. Okay, I will come. Um, I'll come to you know how the whole dashboard works on how to make design. I'll come to that later on. So back to uh, having explained how this create works. Then the next button you see here is recommended for you. Recommended for you is more like a template uh, on your dashboard, templates that this uh, particular software recommended for you. 
uh, logo, uh, blog banner, Instagram posts, YouTube channel, and so on and so forth. All these templates are all recommended for you, so you can easily choose any of them and, and edit your own test. So the next one is my design. My design tab is where all your designs are stored. Okay, all the designs you have made, they are all stored here. All the projects you have worked on, they are all stored here. Then the next one is shared with me. If you have a team member that is using a pick maker with you, right now I have no one, but I can invite them to you know to work on a project to design, do a design project with me. All I need to do is to enter their mail here enter their mail here and i'll send invite invite people i can make them a member i can make them the admin i'll send them invite they'll get a notification in their mail and uh you know they'll be invited to my dashboard and we'll work on a project together then apart from my design shared with me is any design that like you you're you part of a team a design team and someone invited you, you have to see the the design that i'm working on as a team right here then um, on brand kit, brand kit is a tab where you brand your your business. You can upload your logo here. You can upload your your color palette. Let's say your color palette is yellow, white, black. You can upload it here. Then your branded fonts for your your brand. You can put it here. Uh, then brand. If you have a template, brand template. You can also add brand template here. Then another one you have is my workspace. My workspace is. Basically, your people on your team member, people you have on your team member, your admin, and all those information, you can find them here. I have a new blog, frequently uh, tutorials, all these tabs. Then you have your templates, you have pricing, okay? Then coming on pricing, I want to explain something. There are three uh, pricing uh, plans you have free you can start with uh, you can sign up free and this is what the free account comes with business first uh, millions and this is all the the free account comes with but on the starter account uh, which costs this per month or this per year you have all feature to all uh, premium uh, features of this particular uh, platform okay and with starter uh, account you can also sell your designs like you have uh, access to sell your designs on fiverr and other uh, outside fiverr and anywhere you want to sell your designs okay so this is not available on the free version this is only available on the starter version and also on the pro version this is also available on the pro version you can you can scroll down and see you know all the feature that comes with the pro version <music> Hello guys, so I uh, haven't shown you how PicMaker, the whole interface of PicMaker and how you can make money designing graphics using PicMaker. I think it's time to show you how to actually do graphics, do the design proper using this particular uh, app called PicMaker. So let's get started. So first things first, if you want to start designing, you have two options as I mentioned earlier. You can uh, use the create button, okay? depends on the purpose your design wants to serve youtube ads and you know all of those uh, things you can go to customize size if you already have the size in mind and you want to design from scratch or you can come here and search for a particular term relating to a design you want to do any of them or you can scroll down to recommended for you tab okay you see so many templates like the logo these are all logos uh, blog banner, you know, different types of templates that are already made for you that is just waiting for you to use them. Okay, so I think I'm just gonna select one. This particular one catches my fancy, and I'm just going to click on it to be able to use this particular template to design a graphic. Okay, so when it opens up, you have an already made template designed and waiting for you to use to edit your taste. Okay, so in my own case, I just want to edit some things. Okay, like, are you still waiting? Are you still waiting uh, to plan? Okay, something like, I'm just going to edit this. Remember, look at what I did. I want to edit the text. You double click on it. Okay, this kuso comes up. So you just click on to plan your thoughts. Okay, 
with us okay so i think this this looks okay uh for the text then i, I would like to change the 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 color of the the text so where do i do that you go to this particular point make sure that you select the the particular text okay you can change it to yellow you can change it to white anyone that suits your fancy but i love it more white so i'm going to leave it at that you can also select you know more colors are already you know made for you so you can do any one that pleases you then also you can change the font okay of this particular text there are so many of them you can choose from any of this uh, drop down list any font that you want to choose then you can also make it uh, transform the text to all caps okay you can choose it to be uh, small letters capital or all small letters any of them that you want to do then for effects I can add effects like this outline okay I can add effects this effect and I think this looks okay this looks okay this particular effect looks okay and uh, whichever other thing okay then this image there's an image here I would like to move okay when I want to move it you see that is locked something like a, a padlock here so I'm just going to click unlock okay once I click unlock I'll be able to move this particular image maybe to the side here or here uh, then here or here okay then if I want to like transform it twist it a little bit to this angle something like this okay I can leave it this way so uh, having done this I think I'm satisfied with this particular I'm satisfied with it I can add more you know things to spice up the design okay but I'm just showing you generally how to do design here using this particular app called Picmaker. Then by the side, I also want to show you some things. Uh, photos, there is a tab by the side. Okay, there is a tab by the side. On the tab, you see, or if, if you click on, sorry, on templates, you find a uh, number of templates. Okay, for Facebook ads, you find number of templates that you can select from. Then on, on photos, you find so many photos that are already embedded in this particular website. Okay, ready for you to use. Then on objects, you find you know so many objects that are already embedded for you to use then on text you have you know so many texts that are also already made for you to use okay background different backgrounds that you can actually uh, you know put to good use all of these things are just there for you to use okay then if you if you want to upload an image if you want your image to be replaced you know to place this one here okay this is where you also do it and you can upload png svg hike and uh, jp uh, jpeg this is all you know about all these buttons you find here okay guys so i want to quickly show you one feature that i love about pick maker like i so love this feature so much and i know you are going to love it also so this is uh, another template i just opened up another template just to show you this particular feature and you see that this uh, template looks very nice and it's just there but what if you want to look different yeah you don't know how to you know combine colors change image and all of those like to make it unique to only you okay so there is a button here called made all then there's another button here called font there's another button here called colors there's another button here called images all of these will make changes to this particular template to make it unique so let me show you it in action so if you click on mud all okay it will automatically both the fonts and every to automatically change it okay while it, uh, it chose this image uh is because you know i i clicked on middle so it uh, affected both the fonts the colors and the images all together okay but the picture is not looking okay so i'm not i'm not gonna go with this so i will choose to go with okay the font let me see once i click on it do you guys see it it changed the font entirely right so let me reset again then let me show you on the color i love the color feature so much look at this do you guys see it selects and if i keep on clicking it it will select our uh, color variations that will align with this particular design look at it guys it looks amazing right and looks different from what we have okay then on this part is the images if you click on images it will automatically you know select an image that they feel 
will you know suit this particular uh, uh design okay so uh, I, I know it's not looking okay right now so th this is where you know you import the the frame okay this is where you import the frame the image frame and resize it a little bit okay so i think this looks okay so guys th this is the explanation so make sure you try out this feature i i think this feature is top notch and one of the main reason i i love uh pick maker so try it out while doing your designs so after you are done doing your designs you know making your design what you want to do right now is to download okay uh, you have option to present if you want to do presentation or you can click on download so after doing your download and you want to send to your clients next thing you do is to download you can download as png you can download as gpl you can download as pdf anyone that you want or whatever format your client on fiverr asks for it you just click on download or if you want to download as a transparent background for those that are doing logo design you can also click on transparent ba uh, uh, background and download okay so i hope you guys get it uh, is there any other thing i'm missing okay one more thing uh resize resize this is the final one before i round up this video so the resize feature is where you get to you know like we have this originally is meant for facebook ad okay but i want it to be resized into another size okay something like a banner okay i once i select any size okay instagram post instagram post okay i click on resize and this app will automatically resize this particular uh image to this do you guys see it it resized it automatically to facebook post the size do you guys see it which is pretty amazing and pretty awesome to me okay so so how we show you how this particular uh website works how it works and how you can make money on fiverr all you need to do is to please go on this uh website pick maker uh, sign up upgrade to the starter pack for you to be able to sell your designs on fiverr okay get accustomed with the tools on how it works then go on fiverr sign up as a as a seller and uh, open up gigs relating to design not just facebook ads gigs relating to anything design that you know you can easily get done with a uh, pick maker and offer your services and get paid for it uh okay so this is tony saying goodbye for now i hope you guys got value if you have any question relating uh this particular video topic please let me know in the comment section and i'll easily attend to your questions bye for now